What's going on family? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna check out some Chris Webby Raw Thoughts 6. Now this is my first time checking out his music. So this is dope. We're gonna go back, backtrack and check out one, two, three, four, and five. Alongside his other music you guys want me to uh, listen to in the comment section. Um, so listen, man, let's go ahead and get straight into it. Shout out to my subs and shout out to everybody showing love. Chris Webby, let's go. Twenty years after the concept outbreak, brought society to a halt. The United States remained a wasteland between federal rule and over the QZ. Bands of raiders and infected hope seemed to concept long forgotten. But the world reached an undisclosed outpost of Connecticut about a potential cure to the survivors that brought to the drain to find it. All right, so cool. Give me like the uh, survivor mode. Twenty-eight days later, you know. I'm loving that I'm a huge fan of The Walking Dead, so anything zombie related, I'm in there. Rick! <laughs> Carl! Type B, 188 Type B. Okay. <sighs> Here we are again. I wish I didn't have to keep writing these songs. I really do. Hmm. Let me warm up real quick. <clears throat> another time, another year. Another chance to remind these rappers why I'm who they fear. If we're being honest, I've been getting tired of it here. Now it's time to say goodbye and have me sign your souvenirs. Cause this Wednesday's the last one. Really? It's a rap, son. Seven year album rollout. And then when that's done, I ain't really got a plan for what be coming next. But before I dip, you know I got a couple left. Get it mm. on my chest, incline press, all in an eloquent way. If you don't move, you might be catching a straight low key. Yeah, so definitely give me the zombies, the zombie vibes. Uh Walking Dead, Survivor Mode, 28 Days. All the zombie movies are that are that, you know, that are decent. Give me the vibes. Come on. Incline press, all in an eloquent way. If you don't move, you might be catching a straight. Low key, lot of rappers biting webby these days. I'm a proud dad. Who am I to get in the way of all mm. my sons I gave life to? Look at them run. Feel he said, who am I to get in the way? I said, I'm a proud dad. Come dad. on. Who am I to get, get in, in the way? way of all my sons I gave life to? Look at them run. Feels like yesterday I taught them to walk. Now they become so big since I showed them how this shit could be done. Why would I ask for flowers in a game that's giving me none? I'm so independent, I make independent rappers look dependent. Mm. I've heard the business model, other people took the credit. Mm. So get your shit straight. I've been around since that piff mixtapes. This ain't fucking clickbait. Man, when I'm on a and that's way back. That piff. I think the website's even closed down now, man. But yeah, that's way back. That's way back in the good day. The hard mixtape, the little, the little Wayne mixtape era. I mean, those are the good days of hip hop, bro. Good days of rap. Come on. Right. I've been around since that piff mixtapes. Mix this ain't fucking clickbait. When I'm on the road, I'm who they paying to see. Night after night, year after year, remaining to be okay. one of the coldest MCs, undebated indeed. They try but can't replicate being as crazy as me. You know, G in a game full of puppies, and I'm cool, Joe. Yeah, they got some monthlies. They ain't packing rooms, though. They don't know the ciphers where I grew up paying dues. They'll never fit in my shoes. They'll never do what I do. So tell mm. the government they'll get to killing me already. What the fuck you waiting on? I told you, Hillary, I'm ready. But mm. shit, until they get me, we gon' ride it higher now with the bars. Yeah, singing like the Irish side of town. In my mind's derailed, like on mm, the bars, Irish side of town. Okay, let's go. Yeah, with the bars, yes, like the, the Irish side of the town. town. In my All right, because Irish are known for being heavy drinkers, man. All right, come on. Ride it higher now with the bars, yes, like the Irish side of town. Let's get it. Minds derailed like all the damn trains these days. Got me afraid of the rain these days. But okay. the Ukraine these days. Yeah, that's what they want us watching instead of chemical fires and clouds of dioxins. Vinyl chloride killing with the drizzle dropping. Breathing or eating food seeped in toxins. Contaminate our crops and the water that we wash and tell you that it's safe. They some lying motherfuckers. Come now on. it's just another cover up. Really, I mean, what the fuck? All these black rock motherfuckers trying to come for us. Maybe we should come for them. Loading like the muzzle up. Pour some Ohio tap water and fill them up a cup straight from East Palestine. Mm. Make them all swallow it and drive them to their first visit to the young colleges. Two I like years how, later like, when the tumors all throughout the video, he's kind of incorporating what's going on today with even with the, the, the trains all derailing with all the chemicals and stuff getting blown up everywhere and put into the water. But then the people who uh 
who are first on the scene trying to tell the public, oh, it's not a big deal. Don't worry about it. It's not a big deal. But we all know, man. We all know the truth about that. But I like how he's kind of like, this is what led up to where we are today, where where he is today. Survival mode, right? I like that. Smart. Come on. Come to their first visit to the oncologist. Two years later when the tumors all surfaced. Just to look them in the eyes and tell them that they deserve okay. it. We got Klaus Schwab, Bill Gates, all these damn serpents in society lying like they aren't trying to hurt us. The poison us for profit. They've been trimming down our population. Evil is the occupation with the great reset. Okay. Crept and on deck. Sheep following sheep. Our country's falling apart. Biden's falling asleep. They put our rights up on the market <laughs> and they bought them for cheap while selling fear through profit. Listen, whether, whether you agree or disagree you gotta you gotta admit man that's all facts right there let's get it with the great reset prepped and on deck sheep following sheep our country's falling apart biden's falling, falling asleep. asleep they put hey. their rights up on the market and they bought them for cheap while selling mm. fear through propaganda then they wash and repeat and see mm. they tell a boy he's a girl no he's not he's eight mm. how they spread fear using the media to put it put us against each other bro I like what he's talking about. I'm not gonna lie. Asleep, they put our rights up on the market and they bought them for cheap while selling fear through propaganda. Then they wash and repeat. And okay. See. They tell a boy he's a girl. No, he's not. He's eight. That I will not debate, let alone tolerate. Or I like him already. Chris, whatever you are, right with me, man. A boy, he's a girl. No, he's Come not. On. He's eight. That I will not debate, let alone tolerate. Let's get All it. these genders nowadays. How do we accommodate? Most of us are just confused. Why y'all gotta call it hate? Canceling is all the rage. Sanity been tossed away. Kids identifying as animals, and we call them brave. But fuck that. I don't care if it's my kid or not. DCF mm. can have him. I like, I like what he said right there. It's kind of like we encourage the behavior. Not only do we, do we accept the behavior. We encourage the behavior. All right, that's that's toxic, bro. Come on. Animals and we call them brave, but fuck that. I don't care if it's my kid or not. DCF can have them if they shitting in a litter box. Did you get boosted? Well, Charlie Puth did. All these shots fucking with hearts like Cupid. They selling mm. souls to the pharmacist, taking all these shots fucking with your heart like Cupid. I like it. Come on. All these shots fucking with hearts like Cupid. Mm -hmm. They selling souls to the pharmacist, taking blood money and sucking big pharma's dick. Mm -hmm. But listen, that could never be Webby. I'd rather die a martyr than be a motherfucking hashtag Pfizer partner. And mm. I'm not saying that you're stupid if you're vax though, Mr. Fiasco. All I'm saying is I am smart. I know that I'm a fire starter, but I try to tell them all in raw thoughts five but let me add if you got mm. it against your will for job yeah we definitely gotta go back we definitely gotta go back but i tried to tell them all in raw thoughts five but let me add if you got it against your will for a job that'll pay your bills then your bosses should be in jail your doctor should all be and i'm sorry that's how i feel but they were following orders you know who else was following orders nazi supporters fuck all the mm. employers who have a force on their staff <laughs> to be a force with a jab for <sighs> flu Hold I'm on. sorry, that's how I feel. But they were following orders. You know who else was following orders? Nazi supporters. Fuck all the employers who have a force on their staff to be enforced with a jab for a flu that they probably already had to keep a job that gives them all that they have. Free country. How the fuck are we even calling it? I like that, man, because a lot of jobs were requiring you to get vaccinated before you can come back into the building, which is so insane and crazy, bro. I'm not gonna lie, come Already on. Had to keep a job that gives them all oh. that they have. Free country, how the fuck are we even calling it that? Is mm. it like some sick joke? Is it all for a laugh? Have we truly reached a point that we're too lost to get back? Are we body positive? Is it fine to be fat? It's actually healthy according to some scientist stats. But look, Nestle is the company supplying the fat. That's a conspiracy. I'm just not subscribing to that. So get your tin. And a lot of conspiracy theories that people were saying 10, 5 years ago are coming true today, bro. A lot of them joints, man. A lot of them joints. Come on. Company supplying the fat. That's a conspiracy. I'm just not subscribing to that. So mm. get your tinfoil hat and never come back again. Racist colonizer, I will never play your tracks again. Can you say sorry for being white? Not that again. How you blaming me for slavery? Shit, I'm Italian. Mm. Only on your mother's side, see? You just fucking lie. Shut the fuck up, yo. Damn, let me fucking slide. Not getting canceled already. It's been a bumpy ride. Mm. You expect me to run and hide? Never that. I'll be and that's kind of like a common theme that uh, I, I once was kind of like when I first started doing reaction videos, I was kind of like, nah, I ain't buying that. But it's like once you once you start listening to the other side and start hearing people's stories, it's like it all starts to make sense a little bit. You know what I mean? It's like uh, white folks can't really say like they walk on like 
eggshells whenever they're speaking because if they say like something that can be uh interpreted as racist or something like that then they're put all over the internet and they're called racist and they're, you, they get lose their job um so i see i see what's going on now man i'm glad uh we finally came around to it man so uh, let's get back into it cancel already it's been a bumpy ride you expect me to run and hide never that i'll be ivermectin with it yeah i gave him the remedy hit the game with the recipe did it safe and effectively saw the grim reaper just a couple paces ahead of me but we mm. cut a side deal and dug a grave for my enemies and the mm. thing about the truth is what? they don't let us see and the thing about the proof is what? they keep it from me while well, the thing about the news is what? it's made for dummies and the mm. thing about the jews is that's that's all that's all listen I'm liking this song so far. That's all facts because it's like, bro, the media, bro, they ain't really trying to, they ain't really trying to help you out. They ain't really trying to bring you the real unbiased news, man. It's always a spin to it. It's always some kind of gimmick where they try to put you at odds against somebody else and it's getting old. But like I always say, man, people are starting to wake up to it and realize what it really is. So let's keep it moving. Come on. About the news is, it's made for dummies. And the thing about the Jews is, yeah. Wait, did my song censor itself? Hey, so hey, hey. The... Can't, can't say a damn thing. Hey, listen, he ain't lying. They keep it from me. While well, the thing about the news is, <laughs> it's made for dummies. And, and the, the thing, thing about, about the Jews is. is... Yeah. Wait, did my song censor <laughs> itself? Oh, great. Now they'll say I'm anti-Semitic as well. It's all right. And make sure my records never will sell. Say what you will about them, yo. But shit, they clever as hell. Jesus Christ, folks. Oh, yeah, yeah, Are we at yeah, the right. point where as a white guy, I gotta ask if it's fine if I make a white joke? Mm. A little extra mayonnaise up on the side joke. A little, I don't get pulled over. A little over. extra mayonnaise up on the side joke. A white joke. A little extra mayonnaise, mayonnaise up, up on, on the, the side, side joke. joke. A little, I don't get pulled over when I drive joke. Mm. Lighting up, people. We ain't so different. The man, I ain't gonna lie, man. He's putting, he's putting some, he's putting some real shit right now, man. I hate it. I hate, I would hate to be a comedian right now. To be honest, man, because uh, their whole their whole uh, you know, job and their whole career is like, bro, you gotta be you're so damn limited. You're so damn limited, bro. You can't even talk about you can't talk about shit. All the funniest shit in the world you could be talking about, you can't even speak on it, bro. Some of the funniest shit is going on right now, you can't even talk about it, bro. Well, I don't get pulled over when Come I on. drive, Joe. Lighten up, people. We ain't so different. The two teams now are the compliers and the dissidents. Mm -hmm. So pick a side. Ain't no time for you to sit the fence. Say fuck mm -hmm. this. Refuse to be a participant. Come on, man. Let's get back into it. Pick a side. Ain't no time for you to sit the fence. Say fuck this. Refuse to be a participant. Awake yourself from the cloud of cognitive dissonance. Conspiracies are coming true. It's no coincidence. Mm -hmm. The ones in power banking on us staying <laughs> ignorant. That's why they hate us when we give a shit. So listen, cause mm. if everybody gave a shit at once, then their game would all be done. If the people united against the few that run the planet, we would take them in a month. Mm. I don't know what would come after. After all, I'm just a rapper trying mm. to spread truth while I'm still on earth. And sometimes with the truth, the shit gon' hurt. Come Last on. Wednesday, bitch. But before I dip off, I got some people that I gotta piss off first. Webby, raw thoughts. Fuck Ted Cruz, too. I like it. To all my brothers and sisters in the quarantine zones, or anyone else tapped into these frequencies hearing my words, the survivors out there who still have enough fight in them to stand up against the injustice and tyranny of the establishments risen from the shadow of our society's collapse. FEDRA and their affiliate groups seek to keep us in a state of dependence as they rule over us, just like the government elites in times of old. We may be lost, our spirits may be broken, but it isn't over yet. My name is of no importance anymore. All that matters is that I have found the cure they've been keeping from us. Anyone looking to seek refuge and help us take the next steps towards a brighter tomorrow, you have a home with us. To those prepared to dissent, now is our time to rise. And to those whose fear blinds them into compliance, it's time to pick a side. If you continue to ride the fence, you will get caught in the crossfire because there will be a war ahead both of the physical and spiritual kind and if the wrong side winds up on the losing end it very well may be the last war so to anyone looking to interfere and try to further subjugate us Fedra or whoever will be ready mm. cool ain't that it 
We're gonna let we're gonna let we're gonna let the credits run though. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? Let the credits run. So <clears throat> I'm liking this song. I'm liking what he had to say. Um and it might it's like it's like this though. It's like this. It's like this, bro. It might seem like he's dramatizing. He's making everything like so dramatic, right? It's like he's a. Like, you might think that, but over the past five years, bro, we don't seen a whole lot of shit, bro. We don't seen a whole lot of stuff going that we never would have thought we would have seen in our lifetimes, bro. And I do see like a, a the tide, the tide coming, bro. I do see like I'm not gonna lie, I do see like um you know people are starting to get fed up, bro. Um, how people corralled around uh Oliver Anthony's song, um, and all came together no matter like what race that was, and just seeing how music is impacting people, and then seeing how this song right here is and the the su the subject they're talking about is so like, bro, I'm telling you, man, that last scene right there, it might seem like it was being dramatic. I promise you, bro. Uh, people are starting to get fed up, bro. Starting to get fed up. And they want to see a change. Hold on, y'all. And they want to see a change. And they're tired of being silenced. They're tired of being told to be quiet. Don't worry about it. As our country turns to shit. You know what I mean? That's just the real result of it. That's just the real deal of it. Um, whether you agree or disagree, uh, you we all have to somewhat agree that our country as a, the direction of our country isn't where it needs to be going. All right, let's just keep it a stack. While people want to be uh, uh ambiguous to what's going on and not be aware and not really care um and not speak on stuff, the world the world's <laughs> the world's still turning, man. The world's still turning and uh listen man, it is what it is. So we definitely <clears throat> we're definitely gonna go back through one, two, three, and four and five. This was dope. I kinda wanna see what he's talking about. On the previous joints, you guys comment down, comment down below, and tell me what you guys think of the video and the song and the content. I mean, he addressed a couple things. There, I ain't gonna lie. Until next time, y'all be safe out there. Peace.